In this video, we're gonna talk about wiring in a contactor. Now, if you've watched previous videos, you'll see that that same schematic was used when we did our relay, uh, but we can do the contactor the same way. Still have our switch controlling our contactor coil. We have a transformer, so that means we're stepping it down to 24 volts. We have to wire it into our 24 volt coil contactor. So wiring this in, we're gonna wire in our transformer with our hot and neutral. Just like with the relay, we're gonna come out of our secondary into our switch, out of our switch into the relay coil, contactor coil back home. And since this is a 120 volt coil, we gotta fire up that light bulb. So we're gonna come out of our L1. We're gonna go into the contactor. We'll come out of the contactor into our light bulb. So we're right here on our schematic right now. Now there's a couple different ways that we can do this. I can either put this wire and go back through the contactor to get back home. Or I can skip this whole step, take this wire and go right from neutral back home. Since this is just 120 volts, uh, we don't need to use all those extra wires. Turn on our switch. You can hear that snap. Our contactor closes, turns on the light bulb. Turn off the switch, light goes out. Now we still have 120 volts on this side. It's just waiting for that drawbridge to close to send power through there. So that's just a quick introduction on how to wire one of our contactors in our lab.